Now, I'm going to show you the family of alkanes. Now, bear in mind three important things to take note. Whenever you're studying for organics, whether it's alkane, alkenes or alcohol, three important things. One of the three. First, you must always remember their formula and structure. Formula of the alkanes and the structure. How do you draw them? Okay. Second, you need to know their physical properties. Now, this word physical properties is very common that every time when they come out, a lot of people have issue and you don't understand what exactly they are looking for. Physical property means the behavior of that substance or the compound, how they behave in normal condition, right? So, for example, I'm talking about their boiling point and their melting point, okay? And I'm also talking about their density, Okay, and I'm also talking about their viscosity. So these are all these are all the physical property. Now, sometimes I can even talk about their electrical conductivity. Okay, but for this, because they are all organic and they are non-metals, non-metals, they are covalent compound, the chances of them conducting electricity is really low. So I'm not going to write it here. But next one. Now, if I have physical properties, obviously you will lead me to. Yes, you are right. Chemical properties. So, as I guide you to learn about organics in alkane, alkenes, alcohol, and carboxylic acid, I'll be touching on these three parts. We will keep running on through these three parts. So, bear in mind three things, okay? Formula. If you know the formula, you must know the structure. So, they are together. And of course, physical property. If you know physical property, you must also know their chemical reactions with what uh, with other things. Okay, so see you back for more.